Today, Apple announced their brand new money-making gadget, iPhone. It is full of hardware and software updates, but just how did iPhone evolve to be this powerful? This is a hot off the net iPhone special. Hey guys, I'm Dorian Douglas. You might remember the time when Apple announced their first iPod. People rushed to the online message boards to predict the failure of this device. On January 9th, 2007, the same happened when Apple announced the first iPhone. But when the iPhone was actually released, it was received as the best new thing since sliced bread. The first iPhone featured a 412 megahertz ARM processor with a 3.5 inch display, which featured a resolution of 320 by 480 pixels. It had a 2 megapixel camera and was only able to connect to Edge Network. The main part of iPhone, the App Store, did not yet exist. The iPhone 3G was released in 2008 and had the same processor, screen resolution, and camera as its younger model. This iPhone had a 3G connection and a GPS. At that point, the App Store featured around 500 apps. In 2009, the App Store had grown to 50,000 apps and Apple introduced their new model, iPhone 3GS. This model came with a faster processor, 3.2 megapixel camera, and a compass. iPhone 4 was announced and brought to the public in 2010. This had been the biggest revamp of the iPhone so far. Apple got rid of the teardrop-like edges and showed you that you can increase display resolution with its new retina display. You were able to FaceTime with your friends and family through the front-facing camera and the original camera got some needed boost and was upgraded to 5 megapixels and finally brought the much-needed flash. The App Store carried more than 200,000 apps. Today, Apple announced a brand new iPhone. This one features a processor like the one found in iPad. It has a better camera and a bigger display, but the biggest changes are in its software. Apple has gotten rid of the annoying push notifications and made them much more pleasant for the user. It has better voice commands and you no longer need an unlimited message plan since you can simply use iMessage. Are you an iPhone user already or thinking of becoming one? I know I can't wait to get my hands on one. Thanks for watching guys. Tune in next time for the latest that's hot off the net. Bye.